San Antonio Living. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to San Antonio Living. I'm Shelly Miles. Leslie Bull with us this morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm really good because okay. we're making enchiladas today I with know. Deanna. I already mm. tested them. They're quite delicious. So this is a recipe you'll want to make sure you stick around for. Also, I have big news for you. Next Friday, we're doing a live show out at La Fagata, and we would love for you to come and be in our live audience. You can enjoy some of the free food mm -hmm. we've got, margaritas, all sorts of cool stuff happening, but you have to sign up on the Facebook page to go. Okay. Margarita that, that includes in the morning lady. on sure. a Friday. Is there a Look problem out. with that? I don't think so. <laughs> Facebook.com, yes, slash News4SA. Uh, you'll see a little sign up button at mm -hmm. the top. Click on it. It's got all the details there for you. Yeah, sign me. Where's my phone so I can sign, sign up, up for that right now? Okay, one thing you can't bring your dog or cat. No. Apparently, we have an issue with feeding our dogs and cats way too much, and I'm guilty as well. I know you are. <laughs> I'll explain that a little bit later on. Okay. 55% of dogs and cats in America are fat, mm -hmm. meaning that they're overweight or obese. Oh. Okay, we have a cute little pug right there. He that is, is like a tiny, skinny pug compared to my pug. God rest her soul. She passed away over the summer. But an average pug right there is supposed to be between 13 and 18 pounds. So uh -huh. this is an example of how much of a stress it puts on an animal. If it's 24 pounds, that's like a 5 foot 4 inch, that's how tall I am, a woman at two at 193 or a five foot nine That's man at 225. Right, there. right. Oh my goodness. My pug was 28 pounds, but she lived to be 13 and a half. But it's a very serious issue because they can have a lot of the same problems that we humans have yeah. when we carry a few extra pounds, you know, heart disease, diabetes, all that kind of stuff. So my dog is definitely an something that we've got to think about. But I'm guilty too of We had to cut him back dog. down yeah. to a scoop. Sammy's real mad about my, it. But he's getting trim. He yeah. looks very nice right now. My vet recommended green beans. My green dogs beans? would love them. It oh, fills them cute. up, not many calories. I like that a lot. I, I was like trying to eat a lot of green beans, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, Chinese scientists have discovered the perfect cure for a hangover, and guess what it is? Not to drink. <laughs> 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 what fun is that? It's Sprite. Apparently, Sprite is the perfect thing. Really? And here's why. There's a whole bunch of big words involved in this study, um, but the bottom line is this. Your hangover is caused by acetaldehyde, which is ethanol's first metabolite or something like that. I don't know. All you need to know is drink Sprite after a hangover. You're good to go, according to like Chinese Like the next scientists. morning or that night when you get home? The next morning. It will okay. help you. Yeah. Very interesting news coming out of China this morning for you. Also, try that over the weekend. Let us know if it works. <laughs> I'll check it out for you. I'll check it out for you. Uh, another study came out this morning Wait, about how on. much time we're... Get off your cell phone. Hang You're on. contributing Wait. to the problem. Yeah. All right. Apparently, we check our phones 110 times a day. The average person mm -hmm. checks their iPhone 110 times a day, yep, and uh, apparently every six seconds in the evening. It's very distracting, crazy? isn't it? It that is it distracting, mm -hmm. but we are addicted, and that's mm -hmm. our Facebook talker this morning. What is it that you've got on your phone that you're addicted to? Is it... <laughs> Yeah, Deanna's over bust there, too. Her, bust Are you Deanna, posting pictures? <laughs> are you calling your kids? Are you checking your email? What are you doing? Like, mm -hmm. what's that one addiction you've got on your iPhone? Tell us on Facebook, facebook.com slash news4sa. Are you ready to meet our fan of the day? Yes. Let's see if she's on the phone. I <laughs> don't know. It's Angela. Hey, Angela. Yay. Very cool. If you would like to be our San Antonio Living Facebook fan of the day, all you need to do is sign up on the Facebook page. Facebook.com slash news4sa.